Hello, boys and girls, my name is Hotsasi, and welcome to another day in Minecraft, still without mining. And as you can see from my yellow shirt, today we will go back into the nether because we need a few things. From there, as uh, we want to establish a proper uh, villager trading hall and for that we need emeralds. Uh, emeralds we can get from villagers but we also want to get the best possible trades and for that we have to cure them which means golden apples. Um, for golden apples we need gold and apples um, but the gold for that we need a gold farm and that's a long road. So today we will make at least part of the uh, effort uh, by getting on the top of the nether roof and collecting a few items that we will need for that farm. So one thing we need a butt ton of is these blocks. And we already collected a few over here, and it ended tra tragically for us. Got killed by uh, these guys because uh, uh, they were uh, somehow um, in the way of. Uh, the uh, TNT blast, so this will probably happen this time as well. Uh, we can try to minimize the risk, but we will have to see. And then, of course, there's always the risk that uh, things might fall into uh, lava. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okay, it happened. So, what we will do is place a chest here, put everything inside, and then jump into it. For whatever reason, the game decided when I came back from the nether that the portal over there where I went in is not good enough to go back, so it generated a new one uh, roughly 40 blocks down there and you basically have no chance of getting out without drowning. So that's why I am trying to uh, create a new one here in the hopes that the portal on the nether side uh, links with that one and we will have an easier way of uh, getting out. As you can see uh, we are right above the uh, portal and we are already pretty high up so the nether roof should not be that far off but still we have to go a few blocks. And hope uh, there are not too many lava pockets around. Hey, you! 
all this blasting with TNT might be fun, but aren't there easier ways? Yes, of course there are, but after all, this is the No Mining series. So, to figure out what this is all about, check out the uh, introductory uh, video of this series, or check down in the description of this one. There should also be a card up there somewhere. Now, to get on the top of the nether, uh, we have to get to the other side of this block. And at this block, basically, the roof is one, uh, one block thick. And we do that by using an ender pearl. Um, Putting W to get all to the top and then throw the pearl into it. And there we are. So let's see where we are actually standing on because this is the block that we have to break. Um, to get up and down without ender pearls. Now this is the setup how to break block. We want to break the block that is under this piston. And I can only recommend the uh, intro or the uh, description of Sassyfish who explains this way better. So the way I figure uh, this works is we will power this block which will trigger both TNT blocks to get blasted uh, But as one TNT uh, will be processed before the other um, We will uh, Basically Destroy this block for sure this gets rid of the uh, the power source. We will get rid of this uh, this piston, and we want to face a piston uh, if we are if we are under here. We want to face a piston up there, which basically faces down. But as this should happen all in the same tick. The piston seems to be still powered, uh, removing the block below, and then in the next tick, uh, basically the piston uh, seems to be uh, turned around. So if we end up with an upward facing piston, then uh, we basically are done and have a hole in the bedrock so let's make sure we have full hunger and full health as this can potentially be deadly this whole process is a bit finicky and usually it takes a few tries until you get it right especially if you do the clicking manually uh, instead of uh, with, uh, with a clicking script, then it's a bit more random based how fast you can manage. And there we have the upward facing piston. Do we have a hole underneath? Yes, we have. So... basically accomplished the goal for this episode I should have another ladder so in the next one we can figure out where to place uh, our gold farm here on top so we have optimal conditions but that's it for this one 
So join me next time when we start in on the gold farm. Goodbye!